In this unit, we will study causative sentences like one and two. 子供を前に立たせた。子供に前に立たせた。Sentence one is a false causative sentence. Sentence two is a let causative sentence. The contrast between the two types turns up most clearly when the verb is an intransitive verb, as in these examples. The particle O is used for a coerced or unwilling actor. The particle NI is used for a willing or self motivated actor. Here is another pair of sentences that exhibits the contrast between the false causative and the let causative. 私はアキラを先に行かせた。私はアキラに先に行かせた。Before proceeding further, let's study causative forms of verbs. The table to the right shows how to form causative forms from one step verbs. 食べる食べさせる As shown, drop ru and attach させる分ける分けさせる変える変えさせる決める決めさせる。捨てる。捨てさせる。食べさせた。The table to the right shows how to form causative forms from five step verbs. 立つ。立たせる。As shown, replace the last u step syllable with the corresponding a step syllable and add seru. 作る作らせる使う使わせる呼ぶ呼ばせる読む読ませる死ぬ、死なせる。書く、書かせる。急ぐ、急がせる。話す、話させる。The table to the right shows how to form causative forms from irregular verbs. する。させる。来る。来させる。Next, we will learn how to say something like this English sentence in which the bracketed event is caused by the mother. The Japanese counterpart has a similar structure. The caused event appears before the verb seru to cause. The verbs go and cause merge. If the mother fully controls her children's action, use the particle o. お母さんが子供を学校へ行かせた If the mother concedes and allows her children to do something on their own, you can use ni. お母さんが子供に子供だけでプールへ行かせた。The particle o is also used for an unwilling participant in the event. お男の子が女の子を泣かせた。In addition, the particle O is used for a powerless animal or inanimate object that is forced to undergo a change.
子供が金魚を死なせた。So far, we have studied cases with intransitive verbs in which the choice of all or ni makes a difference. Now, consider a sentence like this which contains a transitive verb. The distinction between the fourth and the let interpretation is neutralized, and an unwilling participant also takes ni. This is because the direct object of the transitive verb grabs all. Do not make the mistake of producing an anomalous sentence such as this. Now consider a similar example. お母さんが子供に薬を飲ませた。And one more. お父さんが子供に宿題をさせた。